Okay, so we begin with an overview of Fireworks CS5. Now when we come to the Fireworks interface, so if we're familiar with Illustrator and Photoshop, uh, even Dream, there's a little bit of Dreamweaver and a little bit of Flash in here, we see that our workspace is set up in a very similar way. Now, what is Fireworks? Fireworks is a great software to use when we're getting images ready, especially for the web. Now, what we see is that Fireworks gives us the option of working in both bitmap and vector. We see this option for web, for colors, and for view. Now, as we come on in and we take a look at our Fireworks, um, the, the windows that we're looking at here, the workspace, we can see that we have our document in the center. We have our menu bars up on top. And we come on over and we have all different floating windows as we do in our other programs in uh, with Adobe. We have our different workspaces that we're going to work in. And we'll just set this to expanded mode. Uh, we have layers. Um, pages, states, and the things that we're going to focus on in this next series of videos will be the layers, of course. Um, we're familiar with the history if you've worked in Photoshop. Uh, we are going to take a close look at pages and states. And when we work with animations, we'll work with the states. We have layers. And another big tool that we'll be working with here will be the properties, the properties panel. Now, the properties panel is a window that we see in both Flash and Dreamweaver. So that's a quick overview of our Fireworks workspace. In the next video, we're going to jump right in and begin with creating animations, custom animations that we can export as GIFs and also as uh, SWF files in Fireworks. Thanks so much.